Highlands and Islands. Update. With the latest, I'm Jennifer Bowie. The flow country in the Highlands has been granted world heritage status. Peatland, covering large swaths of Caithness and Sutherland, the largest blanket bog in the world, has been added to the UNESCO list. The site is the first peatland in the world to gain UNESCO world heritage status and the seventh in Scotland to be recognised by the body, alongside the likes of St Kilda and the fourth road bridge. Kenna Chisholm is RSPB Scotland's area manager and a trustee of the Flow Country Partner. It's been recognised because it is a huge peatland ecosystem, but there are areas of it that are damaged and the Flow Country Partnership's ambition is to scale up the restoration of those peatlands and of course that brings jobs to the area, not just for people driving diggers to block drains and such like, but also all the background work that goes into that. A body has been found in searches for a missing hillwalker near Kinloch Leven. The discovery was made at around 7.15 on Thursday evening on Angarvanach near to the Lochaber village. Formal identification has yet to take place, but the family of 64-year-old Ruth Betts, who was reported missing in the area, have been made aware. Police say there are not believed to be any suspicious circumstances. The directors of Financially Troubled Inverness Caledonian Thistle have announced that they've accepted an offer from a UK-based leisure and entertainments company for a majority shareholding in the club. The offer has come from a company called the 77 Ventures Group and the club board, who have accepted it unanimously, say they are confident it will secure the club's future. However, to reach even a 50% voting majority, it appears that around £5 million of new money would be required unless current shareholders were prepared to accept a perhaps substantial reduction in their voting power. This faces the possibility of the proposal having to survive a general meeting of shareholders and the club's AGM is already overdue. Inverness Cali Thistle has pledged to release more information as the process progresses. And finally, Belladrum isn't the only gig drawing crowds in the Highlands this weekend. Hollywood star Russell Crowe and his band will be performing at Inverness's Eden Court on Friday night. The gladiator actor sparked a frenzy in February after a post on social media suggesting a gig in Inverness inviting his Fraser of Lovett relatives. Earlier this year, the 59-year-old revealed he was related to 11th Lord Lovett, Simon Fraser. Crowe's indoor garden party, as well as a performance with his band, The Gentleman and Barbers will take the stage in the Highland capital at 7.30pm. And that's your BBC News for the Highlands and Islands.